The story is about uh, three uh, coffee-loving uh, Frenchmen who discovers a used tea bag in all this coffee landscape, and they uh, start uh, in their quest to find the sinner who is uh, which one is drinking tea in this uh, coffee universe. They start torturing each other, and and uh, lots of things happen. Well, we're not too happy about explaining a lot of the things that goes on in the piece because it's very up to the audience themselves yeah, to kind okay. of interpret what this can mean and it just depends um, on each individual what they kind of find and what they what they see in the piece, I think. Um, but it is all to do with stereotypes, isn't it? He works yeah, it's... Uh, uh, cliches and stereotypes and uh, uh, of Frenchmen and Chinese and our view on Chinese and French, uh, the Frenchmen. Uh, so, but it's a very associative uh, performance. So, uh, each uh, and every person associate different uh, what the, what the story is about. It's a hybrid of uh, dance theater and. Or slapstick, and uh, uh, it's. I th find it uh, entertaining. Uh, hopefully, it's entertaining and uh, and funny. And uh it's a, uh, it's the Ustream and Company universe that you meet in in uh, the society, and it is uh, an artistic frame and artistic choices in that piece that he. Jostrungen, our artistic director, he also uses that in other pieces. So if you've seen one, you would recognize uh, the elements of humor, the elements of dance, the, the situation where there's isolated people um, that get uh, some kind of stimulation from the outside world that kind of triggers the story to evolve. So it's kind of, it's, it's a very distinct I don't know if you could call it recipe, but it's a it's a distinct Ulstrom and Company work, well artwork, and uh, he tends to blend a lot of things in in the in the productions that he makes for the company.